I want to see if you can guess the hidden meanings in these sports logos. Okay. The first one is the NFL logo. Okay. Any ideas? Hidden meaning behind this logo? Yeah. Or hidden images in it? Just anything. I mean, I know the stars are for the divisions. Okay. That's that's all it was. Oh. Um, okay. Because there used to be... <laughs> actually, hold on. I think I have... There used to be a lot more stars on the top half of the NFL shield, but it was redesigned in 2008 and the number of stars was cut, one for each of the league's eight divisions. Got it. Cool. Next one. <laughs> cool. <laughs> the next one is the Pittsburgh Steelers. I've heard it, but I don't remember. Um, it's something with the three stars. Um, that makes sense. I don't know. One star for the big cities in Pennsylvania. It's something. I don't know. The three stars represent materials used to make steel. Yellow for coal, orange for iron, orange for iron ore, and blue for steel scrap. The logo is based on the Steelmark logo of the American Iron and Steel Institute. So that's orange because I would call it red. It does say orange, doesn't it? Yeah, that's it's definitely red. Right? Maybe whoever wrote this article was colorblind. <laughs> it's the green, <laughs> the purple, and the <laughs> and the black. Yeah. Well, got, or, orange is coming in now. Okay. Uh Islanders has um I mean the island in the logo. Okay. That's all I got. Okay. This is one of the cooler hidden things. If you look at the top of the eye in Islanders, it points to the exact location of the team's Nassau Coliseum on Long Island. Oh, because it's like it turns blue. Yeah, and that's where they play. That's really cool. I thought that was pretty nifty. Mm-hmm. All right, the next, the next one, the, the last three are going to hit home. Okay. So the next one is the Capitals. Oh, <laughs> it's got the Capitol building in the breast of the bird. Okay, so I, I never knew that. I thought it was just like the shape of a W. Oh, for it like is that Washington. too. Yeah. And I thought that's all it ever was. Uh, let me see what it says. Do you see the Capitol building formed under the head of the eagle? Is that the Washington Monument shaded in blue above it? It could be. I mean, it's just a point. Maybe, maybe not. Apparently, hiding national landmarks and logos is a staple of D.C.-based sports teams. Yeah, let me see some Redskins then. Oh, yeah, that's got the... Yeah, there it is. I mean, that one's obvious. <laughs> the next one is the Washington <laughs> Wizards. Yeah, uh, obviously. <laughs> so I, I never knew that. I don't Washington think Monument. I ever really... Yeah. Just, just big and hard right in the middle there. Within the Washington Wizards redesign logo, there's a subtle representation of the famous Washington Monument. I like how they had to throw famous in front of right. that. <laughs> All right. The O's, hon. Um, damn, I'm in an O's shirt, too. Is a hidden meaning in this? Hold on. Let me look at it. So, okay. I'll let you, I'll let you gander. This one kind of hit me by surprise. Is it, can I get a hint? So this one isn't really hidden. It's more of a debate. Does the Oriole have its mouth closed and smiling or completely open? Mm. Because it doesn't connect. And I never realized that. So is it open and it's smiling? Like, why? Like, or is it, they just didn't finish the logo? Now that you said that, I'll never not. I know. See that? And I was excited about that. I was like, Chris is never going to forget this. Do you see? I'm he's like, eh. now that I see it, I'm going to say his mouth is open, open. Beca because that orange outline is the whole logo. It's yeah. not part of the beak. It's the black right. line. That's the beak. And then there's no connection. So I'm going to say his mouth's open. Yeah. Okay. Also smiling though at the same time. Yeah. Just mouth was open. God, I can't unsee it now. I, don't, <laughs> I really, because in my head, I would say, oh, he's just smiling. But yeah. now that you've said that, yeah. ugh, I don't Same. like it. Same. 